Hey, what's going on, sexy seven little squad? Today we're here doing a ranked one v one, and uh, I think today we're gonna play Apollo and we're gonna go the bow build. Oh, I was gonna play Bakasura with the bow build too right before this. I was thinking, oh man, maybe I should do Bakasura, but I haven't played Apollo in like forever, actually forever. <coughs> so this could have been a Bakasura mirror. So I'm kind of glad that uh, my brain decided to go with Apollo instead. Let's go, dude. I think I just go tier two, this thing. I'm not gonna do much damage at all initially. Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Doesn't matter. Go shell. I could also. I have the option to go beads as well here, because I can beads and then uh, use my three. Ugh. Excuse me. I just woke up. I think that, like, when I started this recording, I'm pretty sure that's, like, the first words I've said all day, so. Please forgive me. Did Apollo get new card art again? Or do I just not play this guy ever, and every time I play him, it looks like new card art? That's probably more likely. Oh, by the way. Uh, on the 9th of September, starting at 6 p.m., as always, I'm doing a 24-hour stream, boys. I know you've been missing them. It, it's been almost two months since the last one, but, uh, you know, sometimes you need some time to recover yourself <laughs> after after those events. But we're back. We're doing another one, another 24-hour stream. I think I kill you here. Well, if I could land the auto attacks. Are you going to go eat a minion? You are. Okay. But yeah, there's a... Uh, we haven't really figured out any of the nuances of the stream yet. Like what, what we're giving away or what we're doing. But as always, you can expect some spectacular shit out of those streams. I would not worry too much about it. Just make sure you show up September 9th. And that, by the way, was perfect for me. Because you can try to kill me all you want, but, like, we both know you're not going to kill me. Um. Oh, he's still alive. Look at that, dude. Look at that, dude. Oh, I don't have enough yet. Alright, he is going to be able to get that buff, probably. Okay. Mm. Pretty sure he's just going to eat it, right? I might be able to kill him. Okay, never mind. Not if I completely whiff my ult. Then again, he's going aggro here, which I don't think is going to help his case at all. Uh, I don't know. I guess with the blue buff and all the cooldown, like, you're fine. That sucks. Oh, okay. Okay. I really feel like I could kill him here. Nice. Nice. That was a very, very important that he jumped on me there. Important for me, not for him. It was not good for him, <laughs> obviously. But it was really good for me. So I will take it. Basically, I was completely banking on the fact that he saw me at low HP and didn't even care to look at what my relic was. Because I knew his relic was beads. He used it for me when I when we were right here, when I mezzed him. So I knew he had beads. What I didn't know 
was if he knew I had shell. And judging by the aggression, obviously he didn't know, but you never be too sure. That's why super late shells are really good, by the way. Because you can use them to bait fights where they think they're going to win, and it's just straight up they have no chance. Although I will say, it's not always the smartest play to bait a fight like that. Because Shell reduces auto attack damage you've taken by 20%. So, or you're going to take by 20%. So popping it in the middle of a fight while you're doing the boxing is also good. But you don't have the bait potential of maybe he just wants to kill me. It only really works when you use it last second for the first fight, if I'm honest. Okay. You do not scare me at all. Oh man, I do a lot of damage to you. Um... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Figured it. No, if you think I'm letting you back, you're out of your damn mind. You better run all the way back, boy. You better run all the way back. Thank you for the speed buff. See you later. I'm going to try to get this too. The way I'm going to do this. Oh, he got it. Dude, I'm actually destroying these fights, though. Oh. I would stay, but I mean, there's no point. He knows that I have shell. He's not going to fall for it again, probably. So it's fine. It's fine. I'm still ahead by 600 gold almost. Um. By the way, I know a lot of people don't remember this map too much. But uh, the speed buff in this map also gives you 10% attack speed. It's not just movement speed. So, on gods like Bakasura and most hunters, I actually think the speed buff is better for you than, like, red. And obviously, most times, I think it's better for you than blue, too. But, my guy, I am critting the absolute living crap out of you. I'm ulting him. Wow, imagine if I could land autos, though. Like, just imagine. Imagine if I didn't whiff 85% of the autos there right after I landed. But that's the whole reason I'm going to go in the bow build, baby. Because when you can't land autos, <laughs> overwhelm them with sheer amount. <laughs> and when there's enough of them in the air, obviously some of them are going to hit. Right, I'm backing. I'll go. I'll go Silver Branch now. Why not? I want to go all the bows, by the way. And uh, I guess I want to go. There's four bows. Then I can go Kins and Toxic Blade for damage, or or to go Griffin Wing and Toxic Blade. Because Griffin Wing is 25% attack speed instead of 20. Do I have as much damage? Obviously not, no. But... Hold on. You get the buff, but I am annihilating you. And you have no jump up, bro. Oh, you're so dead here. Unless you blink. You don't. Oh, damn it. I forgot he was so fast because of his passive. Oh, I am Golden Blade.
All right, fine. Fine, you're Mr. Alive for now. How does a weapon enhance my magic? Yeah, I think I just go Aegis. I don't want to get comboed by an alt, man. That doesn't sound super pog. I think what I want is... Well, obviously I want full build. So I want to see how many silver branch stacks I get. I am at 19 with my passive right now. Um... Where is he? Oh, okay. I was thinking he was at Bull Demon. Hello? Oh, I'm at 20 with my Silver Branch stacks now. This is the attack speed you gain from leveling up, I guess. Oh, build, baby. Dude, he's going to surrender. I'm just being so annoying. I'm being so annoying. Think you you think you can back? You think you can back in this household? No siree. I think this is a pretty bad matchup for Bakasura. I mean, I guess he could go like Hayes and Katana and try. But still, I mean, that's not great for him. Uh, holy crap. I'm one sleepy boy. Thank you. Extra attack speed for the silver branch stackies. I wonder if he's waiting at red. Oh. My guess is he's not waiting at red. Damn, 35 stacks right now. 35 Silver Branch stacks already. And I am three and a half items in. <clears throat> now let's grab this. Hello. Oh, man. I could ult him, but I feel like I'll just die. <laughs> he might lose his Phoenix here, actually. He should not have stopped my back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Saw that coming. No, thank you. But I actually think I can kill him here. Yeah. Okay. Holy dude. Holy crap. I am so annoying. I'm so annoying. How is he supposed to do anything against that? <laughs> this matchup is like impossible for Bakasura. And I do feel bad. Because, like, he doesn't deserve to feel like his character is useless. But also, I mean... Hold on. Bless me. Also, when you pick Bakasura in duel, you kind of expect the shit on your opponent. Like, it's almost like you expect the win before the game even starts. Because you pick Bakasura. So I don't feel that bad. 36 stacky boys without my speed buff. Alright, I almost got my Griffin Wing too. Griffin Wing is 1900? Oh, 1800. Damn, Griffin Wing's cheap, bro. Hello. Oh my gosh. That's one thing about the bow build is you have a little bit of everything, which is why I love it so much. And uh, by the way, I don't just do the bow build for, for meme videos. I actually use the bow build like genuinely in casuals and everything. I actually build 
this stuff because you have great boxing with that first off hold on i think i just had 53 stacks of silver branch um but you have boxing potential with Ichabal and atalantis gives you crit chance and life steal you have 20 percent pen with silver branch and attack speed and clear with oboe like you just have everything you could ever want i feel like yeah look at that 54 stacks of silver branch i still have another item to go I still have a 30% attack speed item to build. A Toxic Blade. I'm not actually not going to hit these minions. Because I want my minions to stay in Phoenix range. Actually, they will. Dude, I do too much damage. Rose not up. Like, how is he supposed to fight me, though? Really? Look at this. Bro, I don't even have to move. I can stand there like a turret against a Bakasura, who, by the way, actually used his shell, and I didn't use mine, and still win the fight. I, I'm telling you guys, you got to check out the bow build. If you think it's just a meme you're wrong and you need to go you need to go play it and you need to go see what i'm what i'm seeing it is very very good hello bakasura do you think you can win this fight of course you do oh well maybe it's because you can't <clears throat> well Rest in peace, Phoenix, I guess. <laughs> I think he caught... Did he, I think he caught my dash with his ult. Or he immune to my mess with his ult. One of the two. He did something good with his ult. That's okay. I'm not worried, though. Oh, that's unfortunate. He didn't even get my Phoenix. All right. I would pick up red buff, but I want to see what my silver... Oh my God, I'm at 64 stacks. 64 stacks without speed buff. I got to see it, bro. 21? No shot. Sixty-nine. <laughs> There's never better been a better way to win the game, bro. Never been a better way. Sixty-nine silver branch stacks. We take those to the bank and cash them in. Let's go. Okay, I had to kill him one more time because uh, him murdering me was a sin that had to be reconciled. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.